Hey guys, welcome back to another video. It's me, Slick Brawl Stop on J here, and today we're gonna be showcasing my deluxe edition pack. I got this today, and if you guys know, if you guys bought it as well, it comes with the Z7 Imp. And I've got him. I'll, I'm gonna be showcasing him, but last. You guys aren't even gonna see him. I'm gonna be showcasing him last. So we're gonna first be showcasing all the characters I got from the fertilizer fun pack and my brand new two abilities I think I got for from the deluxe edition pack. So the deluxe edition is basically um $23 because it charges $10 with the standard edition and it also charges $12 and 49 cents, but it does not show for some reason i'm not sure why but i was kind of upset of that too but i thought it wasn't it was a big deal but i wanted to showcase the z7 imp and the brand new abilities right today so oops i actually spawned out here so you guys just see his face that's it but um we're gonna be showcasing the abilities first cosmic brains now you guys know i already have cosmic brains um, I'll also be showcasing my brand new characters I got from the fertilizer farm pack, like I said. And Cosmic Rains, I got a new ability for him. I could use a su super multi, um, super ball or something like that, I forgot what the name. And it does extremely, extremely a lot of damage. Better than the normal, um, one, because it's like, it's so OP, 60 damage per ball. And I'm saying that's really strong. Next one is I got the wrestling star. I'm not going to be showcasing him. He's not such so important. But next up is my brand new rose. I got the druid rose. This guy is my favorite rose so far. I always wanted it. I really wanted it actually. And I finally got this guy. I kept buying the fertilizer fun pack until I got him. And this um, turns out I got 221,000 coins. I spend them all in fertilizer fun packs. And it turns out I get a whole bunch of brand new characters. So I'm like, why not showcase those as well? And it came with the Druid Road, which is good. And this guy, I think he does a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of damage. So yeah, he does about five damage per hit, that is? That's a lot. So five times 30. Let's check this out there. That's 90 damage after all of that. So we'll say that's pretty okay. It's okay, but critical. Let's check it out. So wait, it doesn't show critical. Oh, there's no critical damage. Oh, that sucks. I guess the toxic and critical isn't really that much of a fair deal. But oh well, who cares? At least we got this. Eh, let's go use this. These guys will not leave me alone. Now let's go ahead and use that. Take out that one, then they're gonna ram me, I know it. Yep, they ram me. Come on, let's take them out. They're gonna be poisoned. Toxic to death, huh? What? Oh, whatever, just get wrecked. Get wrecked, me. All right. And Weldar appears. Come on, come on, take him out, take him out, take him out. What I really got wanted to show you guys is the brand new ability I got for the corn. And you guys probably already know it. it comes with the deluxe edition. It is called the Bigger Better Butter. It's so, so OP. First of all, this thing does a lot of damage. I'm saying a lot of damage it could take out that welder right there if it stands still and sorting, no i really want to test out that thing uh wrestling star get shrek me let's take that guy i really want the multi rocket but i think that will be coming out soon Just brown coat leave me alone so let's keep waiting until this ability regains and come on, come on. I'm gonna get one of these guys to come to me. If we go out of the way dangerous. Watch this. Watch this. Boom. Get shrek to me. 
So that does a lot and lot, a lot, a lot of damage. This can definitely take out your um, opponent or um, your friends. It's so strong if they were becoming an imp, they would get taken out critically if they were standing, came in that direction, taken out one hit by the bigger, better butter. So that thing's OP. I recommend you guys should use that a lot because it's so strong. Next up, we're moving to the next character. Well, is this gonna happen again? Hold on. No, okay. Wow, two hundred. Wow, did you guys see that? Two hundred damage. So definitely, that could take out your opponent right there, if they become any character. But I don't think it's like seriously gonna take out them immediately since they have like the all-star has 200 and the super brains has 200 so not immediately they might have like 30 like 25 health left next out is the hot rod chomper i got and the toxic chomper um we're gonna showcase both hot rod chomper he goes fast basically if you eat the people i got the, all the abilities with the chomper as well sprint barrel all these cool abilities spiky spike we chomp thing um, and also I got the super sticky goop, which is basically all the abilities. Next chomper I got was the toxic chomper. All I need, I think is the disco chomper. No, I need the yeti chomper and the disco chomper. Toxic chomper is my favorite chomper I got out of all these chompers, chomper, chomper. Oh my God. Okay. <coughs> but he is my favorite. He does a lot and lot of damage. I don't want to test him out right now. But we will be testing it out soon. Um, next is Sunflower. I got every, wait, no I don't. Oh, no, I got every single cactus. I'll showcase that maybe in the next video, which is tomorrow. Alien Flower. This guy, he's pretty good. He does splash damage a little, not really splash, but he has some kind of powder or something that spreads for a while and that could take out your, your enemy, basically. Next, I got the vampire flower. People say this guy sucks. Oh my god, people, why would you say that? <laughs> vampire flower is like the best character in the game, first of all. It doesn't matter about the health. It, all that, all right, if you're going up against a regular Z7 imp and a vampire sunflower, a vampire sunflower was, was, is gonna still win. He can't even stand it. The, okay, the imp cannot even stand a chance against a vampire. It could dodge its attacks if it if you have like those little like flowers that attack. I forgot what they're called. And the soul flare being you stand, they stand no chance. It does immediately a lot of damage, 14 damage per hit, 40 times 14. I'm not gonna multiply 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 that because that is really a lot and really a lot of damage as well. And all the damage the mech does against you, you just gain it back. And all it's just doing nothing, actually. But if the mech is so strong and you only drain 8% of health, then it might have a chance to take you out. So I recommend keep moving while you're attacking the imp and place down this so it can help you out. And that should work. And use your solar flare beam only when you're hiding. So that is what I recommend. Next character, what I got are all the cactuses. So far, I like the Zen Cactus. That is my favorite cactus I got. And um, Fritrify Cactus is the best. Are you serious? I never knew that. This guy does a lot of damage 40 times. Let's see. Five. So the, it does 40 damage. And 40 times five is about, let's see, 40. Uh, it does 200 damage. So that's a lot of damage, actually with all those mystic orbs that could take out a yeti if it has like half health or like half health split that could take out that yeti immediately so that is op next cactus i got was called the camel cactus this guy does a lot a lot a lot a lot a lot of damage it takes forever to actually um reload your camel shot you don't reload it but you kind of like you wait for like three seconds and shoot again. One, two, three, one, two. Okay, no, only like two seconds you gotta wait and then you hit again, but one, one, two, one, one, 
two. See? One, two, all right. Two seconds, that's a lot. And this does, let's check out how much damage this does critical. Let's see if we can maybe, wait, how about that? Wait, got him. 50 damage, so that's a lot of damage. That was actually a good hit, you gotta end it. I, I don't know if that was critical or not, but oh, who cares? Let's check out, just to double check if we showcased every character we got. Da -da -da yeah, all of them. Nope. Z7imp. I would never forget about this. Z7imp. All of you guys have been waiting for this one. He is rare. R rarity is special. It's not super rare or legendary. It's special. The reason it's special is because you get it from the PS Store Deluxe Edition. And that's why they call it special. Also, the Unicorn Chopper is special. But unfortunately, you, they don't sell those anymore. Which is sad. And... But at the same time, it's fine. So, let's test out this C7 amp. C8 amp, no, the Z. All right, so what you gotta do, if you wanna attack, you go like this. This is beginners. Beginners go attacking this. Guys, keep clicking, keep attacking the right trigger. Look, watch. It does a lot of damage, actually. It does 14 damage right now. You gotta get them critical and close. So you gotta go a little close and right here is perfect. And get that jar on the head. I gotta get him. Hold on, let's try out that. So if you gotta be close to them, I know. It does about 12 damage or more. We're gonna go ahead and uh, you guys are gonna see the um, the mech when we go in the gate and summon in these bosses. This is gonna be OP. I'm so excited for it. Yeah, see? 14 damage. You gotta get them in the head. Helmet. Now they're helmet run. It, when you're going against your um, friend or opponent, guys, you guys gotta go on your aim. Keep attacking them on the head, okay? It does the most damage, okay? Hold up. What is that? Just a, yeah, right when I say that, I was just about to say so no one gets lost. But they go on other ways. Come on, where's that cactus? Yep, I see it. Thanks, it, it's not doing anything. You gotta be a little close to them. These guys out, and then we're gonna go in the gate and spawn in my mech. Hopefully, this is gonna be amazing. Hopefully, there's no no mistakes in the mech. Hopefully, yeah. there can't be any mistakes. Let's go test this out. Let's test this baby. Just take out that. And wow, future cactus, you are really cool. Let's go in here, and we gonna need you. Hopefully, he comes in. Three, two, one, mech spawn. Da, da, da. This thing's OP. All right. No, I can't. Freaking awesome. That sucks. That'd be awesome if you can. would attack you or your uh, friend it's really easy to take down and i'm pretty sure the vampire sunflower like i said can take this guy down because it does 14 damage per hit this guy does critical i think 14 as well wow they just want to leave their base interesting i'll bet that so you gotta be a little close to them i don't know if that's not close enough but it's fine is that druid road here yep it is Good one. Let's take out this torch wood. Take out this. 
this guy. And yeah, you gotta be a little close to them. That's how the damage works. Damage buffs work. I'm gonna go ahead and end the video right there. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Just to double check, let's see if we got all the abilities. Yep, 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 and yep. Nope. Have we test out the druid? All right, just in case, double check. This is the druid rose. Um, if you guys saw it, I'm not sure if you guys seen it yet, but this is my favorite rose out of all of them. Um, he's OP and he does a lot of damage per hit. I think he does five. Yeah, he does. So five times, let's see, five times 30, or yeah, that is five times, yeah, okay. So that does about 150 damage, which is pretty dang good. Let's, take, let's get this guy critical. There's no critical hits on this, but the toxic and everything is critical. So look, we're just gonna save that. But we're gonna go on and end the video there. If hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please smash that like button and subscribe. Please, please, no, I'm just kidding. Um, um, please smash that like button and subscribe down below. It won't be description, but it's fine. I'll see you guys in the next Garden Warfare video or other videos, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye. Peace out.